Hi, welcome to the I'm Ready Test Kitchen. My name is Lauren and today we are making what I like to call a guava sunrise. We'll be using our agave nectar clear and our guava craft puree. Our guava craft puree is the perfect way to infuse guava into any of your favorite beverages. It contains the real fruit so you know it's going to have very authentic flavor. And unlike buying a fresh guava, which is really, really hard to do, especially depending on the time of year, this is available year round and it's gonna have consistent flavor every single time you buy it. And I thought that, you know what? We're later in spring, summer's getting closer. I figured let's make a tropical drink. So we'll be using two kinds of rum. We have regular clear rum here and coconut rum. And we'll also be adding in some lime juice and some pineapple juice. So let's get to shaking up this fun tropical cocktail. So we're gonna start by just adding everything into our shaker. That's literally all you need to do for this. Add some ice after that, shake it, strain it over ice and boom, you're done. You have a delicious cocktail, easy as that. So I'm going to be doing one pump of our agave nectar. And then one and a half pumps of our guava craft puree. Next, we're going to juice in half of a lime. Oh my gosh, and it smells so good. If you've never smelled guava before, just it's so fragrant, it's so juicy, it's very tropical. I'm also going to be putting in an ounce and a half of pineapple juice. I personally like to get the juice that's in a can or freshly squeezed. That is going to give you the best flavor. Sometimes when you buy it in like the plastic um, shelf stable containers, it has a little bit of a funky flavor to it. So we want really nice, sweet pineapple juice. So now let's put in our white rum one and a half ounces. And lastly, our coconut rum. We're only going to be doing half of an ounce. We don't wanna go overpowering on the coconut. We want to be able to taste all of the other flavors in here. So just enough where you get the flavor, but it's just not intense. We're not making a pina colada. We are making a guava sunrise. All right. Add some ice and give it a good shake. Boom, there you have it. We're gonna take all of this and just pour it straight into our glass. No need to strain. Just pour it in. I'm going to just top off with a little bit more ice. All right, let's get a garnish on here. I have just a lime wheel and some brandy cherries. I thought that would be a really nice addition. And the cutest little cocktail toothpick. I found these little starfish ones, and I figured literally what's more fitting for a guava sunrise than a starfish cocktail skewer. So that's what we're using. Let's get a straw in there. Give it a try. I'm in Cancun right now. Feeling like I'm on a tropical vacation. This is incredible. Very, very ready for summer, and I'm sure you guys are too. So give this a try and take yourself on a little tropical vacation for a moment. And soon enough, it will be actual summer and we can enjoy the sunshine and good weather. So cheers. Well, thank you so much for watching. I really do hope that you give this a try. And if you do, please let us know in the comments below what you thought about it. Also, make sure you subscribe to our channel below and you'll never miss any new recipes or tips and tricks. Be sure to follow us on social media too. You can find us as at Amoretti on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, and Pinterest. See you next time. Bye-bye.